What's popping YouTube? It's your girl Jay, and I'm back to pop my sh again. Hey you guys, a long time no see, but here I am back again with another video. Make sure you guys subscribe and also check the description box below for all of my social links. Follow me on all the socials and also check out outloudllc.org to purchase your mental health coloring book, journals, pens, stickers, and more. So as you guys can tell, this is going to be a video about basically pretty much, I want to talk about um being at peace with your current situation and the reason why i want to talk about that today with you guys is because that is pretty much one of the main reasons um that i'm not as active on youtube um because i'm a lifestyle vlogger and because you know um my current situation isn't exactly where I want it to be I feel like I've just became so inconsistent with YouTube and I'm working on that um I'm pretty much going to make sure I have a video coming out every week on here but also just being at peace with your current situation because a lot of the times we get so caught up in what our current situation is that we don't take the time to just be at peace cherish the moments like I was having a conversation with a friend and you know we were talking about just you know how we feel like we're wasting our youth and we're not really just maximizing our youth and having like the most fun right now because you know we're just in hustle grind mode trying to get to the next chapter of our life and honestly that's not a bad thing like you have to be okay with your current situation especially if you're like me and you have the mindset that's like okay eventually I know my time is coming I know I'm going to get to where I want to go um the end goal is still the end goal but right now this is where God has me and this is where he wants to be so what can I do in this moment how can I become a better per person in this moment how can I cherish this time you have to be able you have to be able to like literally cherish the moments that you have right now so when you get to where you're going you can be more appreciative of it and it is very hard to come to terms and be at peace with your current reality because you know of course if you're anybody like me you're really really hoping for that big breakthrough understand that it's going to come but just be at peace with where you are now and the ways to do that is number one first and foremost pray 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 I'm getting closer and building my relationship with god it's not where i want it to be just yet because i'm not gonna lie like usually when you're in those moments and you're still trying to figure everything out you're still trying to get everything together um and you just feeling all down and out about your current situation you forget to like pray or not even necessarily that you forget to pray or forget to be in your word it's just like it makes it harder to do so because especially if you've been praying you've been in your word you've been going to church you've been doing all these things and you're still not seeing things come to fast you have to understand that you have to keep praying and you have to have faith that everything is going to work out as it should so building that relationship with god keeping god first and everything that you do is really the answer to all of your really questions that you have in life like really just making sure that you are really in that word and really building that relationship because if god isn't in the midst of what you do nothing is going to work out so it's so important to take time to just pray and just thank god for where you are and just show gratitude even though it is super super hard like i even know like now like i just feel so I don't even know the words like I honestly cannot even describe the way I feel into words because I'm not gonna lie I'm so heartbroken even as it comes to like my YouTube like I don't know what to post on here um the only thing I really can do is just post whatever I can post right now and just you know pray for the best and and that's what it's all about you know just praying having faith and just doing what God you know wants you to do and that's just showing up as your true authentic self doing what you can like of course we want to excel and succeed beyond um what we're doing now but it takes time it takes time you're not going to get there 
like this another way to become at peace with your situation is also to stop comparing yourself um i don't really compare my life to others i'll be honest um of course like there are moments where i feel like okay yeah i should i compare myself to my life um that i feel like i should have right now like that's what i compare myself to like i'm like oh girl you know you supposed to be um in um award-winning movies and award-winning shows right now so i compare myself to where i think i'm supposed to be right now and obviously that i'm not there so as far as like comparison because comparison is the thief of joy you cannot compare your life to others and you can't compare your life to where you think you should be same thing it doesn't matter if i'm comparing my life to anyone else's if i'm comparing my life to um a life that's just not my current reality that's still comparison right even if it's you know where i feel like i should be um comparison is a thief of joy like find moments find little things that you could be happy about in this time because constantly comparing yourself and i'm going to speak you know from you know like i said from the terms of me comparing myself to where i felt like i should have been by now constantly comparing myself to where i feel like i should be by now has definitely like broke my heart even more because i'm constantly dwelling on like oh i should be here oh i should be there oh this is what i'm supposed to be doing right now why am i not doing it i'm not finding the you know small moments in my life i'm not giving myself those time i'm not giving myself that time and finding those those small moments in my life where i can just be joyful and just actually like embrace where i am because it's a beauty in the struggle like it's beauty and i just wish like uh and this is why i feel like it's so important for me to continue to do what i'm doing as far as just sharing my story and just being open on my social media it's not even just on youtube on tiktok and on instagram follow me on there as well but this is why it's so important because we need more people to just really like share their true raw authentic life just wherever they are because it's coming like it's coming like don't compare yourself to where you feel like you should be and don't compare yourself to someone else's life you can get there whether it's where you think you should be or it's or if maybe it's somebody else that you're inspired by still don't come you could be inspired by somebody but don't constantly compare yourself to that person get in the field like and get in the field put in the work because you can have it like and i know it's harder said than done because it's it's truly it's truly a skill to like really like be like okay i know i'm not where i'm at but let me just calm down especially when you've been down for so long and y'all that's how i feel like and i'm just tired like i'm tired i don't know what to do at this point like that's why i said i just have to just work with what i got start and just do what i gotta do like it's it's time out for comparison it's time out for not being happy with my current situation i might not be happy with my current situation but that doesn't mean that i have to dwell on it that doesn't mean i have to compare it to where i feel like i should be or compare it to someone else's life right find peace find the moments that you love right now about you and take that and use that pain that's another that's going into my third point using your pain and turning it to purpose that is another way that you could be at peace with your current um situation all the pain that you're feeling everything that you're feeling like whatever it is like maybe you're feeling sad because you feel like oh you should be making more money now or maybe you feel like you should be married with kids by now whatever it is that you feel turn that pain into purpose okay so right now i'm not here but i'm going to use this feel these feelings that i feel and i'm finna turn it to purpose my purpose i'm finna turn it to getting to where i want to be i'm about to all these feelings that i feel this pain that i feel i'm finna use this as ammunition to you know go on more dates to find my man or put my energy into my business so i can make more money or you know go find a better job so i can make more money whatever it is that you have to do you have to take those steps and really just understanding that it's going to come and you just really have to just use that pain and and 
turn into something good. You know, instead of just being sad, sulking, and wallowing in it, get up. Like, get up. Do something. Like, even today, I told myself, I'm not finna sit in the house today. I'm getting out. I'm about to film a YouTube video. I'm finna do my hair. Um, I did my real hair today, y'all. looks so good. I was like, I'm finna do my makeup. And I'm finna, like, film something. Even, um, I didn't feel like going nowhere you know, I just was like, I'm going to do a little car video. It is what it is. But I'm getting up. I'm making those steps. And also consistency and just understanding that in order to be at peace with your current situation, you have to be busy. You have to keep yourself on a constant move. Like, don't stop. Don't sit down. Don't think about it. Just keep going. And, and have the moments where you can just sit and be like and feel your feelings but right after that snap out of it and just you know do what you gotta do like it's not the easiest thing and i'm still battling with a lot mentally like me my mental health is so much better than what it used to be but i'm still dealing with a lot mentally because i'm still trying to really get in that mode to where it's like okay i'm not letting this current situation i'm not, not letting anything get to me i'm just going i'm going i'm going but also sometimes too like i'm human i have my days i have my days i have my ways i have my days where it's like oh my gosh like i'm just feeling so i can't i just don't understand you have to also surround yourself with people that understand your current situation like if you're in a situation where you know you're down right now don't hang around people or don't be around people that's gonna make you feel like you're down you need to be hanging around people that's gonna make you feel like you on top of the world like relationship par partners friends family all of that like having a, a good circle around you is good and if you don't have those people around you be by yourself in this moment like you have to find peace within your current situations and also blocking out the noise for people that don't understand your current situation you got some people that'll come around and be like oh well why you why you doing this or why you why you can't do this or they're trying to put their projections and project their life onto you and things like that don't let that get to you block out that noise and understand that whatever it is that you're going through find that peace in that moment meditate pray and just be okay with where you are and i know it's hard it's easier said than done because like i said i'm still battling with this i'm still trying to find peace in my current situation i'm still trying to find the the best you know flow of you know where i can just constantly be at a place of just getting things done and just feeling the best like to do it we have to do it i'm not making this video just for y'all like i'm currently in in the situation that i'm talking about and i feel like that's what makes my channel and my content so powerful because it's like i'm not talking about this after i didn't made it through like i'm showing you guys real true raw authentic moments of my life and even just now i just did this video and this was off the off the top like this came from the heart because i'm truly trying to get better at being at peace with my current situation because like i say i could like i said i compare myself so much to where i feel like i should have been by now and i hate that for me because it's like i know that i'm making progress and i know that i'm going to get there i just have to keep pushing myself and i also have to block out the noise i also have to pray i also have to stop comparing myself to where i feel like i should be i'm not there so let me take these moments let me turn that pain into purpose so i can get there right so it just it takes it's a process it's a process but it's something that we have to do it's something that we need to do also fill your day up with like things that just make you happy like hobbies like working out makes me happy go work out like certain things like whatever your hobby is just start you know form a hobby find joy in the moment right now while you have it because constantly trying to get to the next chapter of your life and you're not like really basking in what you have right now in front of you it's not always the way to go so you have to really take a moment ground yourself in the environment that you're in feel the emotions that you feel but also understand that 
You can't sit in it. You can't soak in. You can't wallow in it. You have to keep going. And anytime I have those moments, I have to snap myself out of it quickly because it's just it's so hard especially those moments where like oh i, I want to just sit sulk and so and and just wallow in my misery because it's like i don't know what else to do in this moment because i'm not happy with my current situation i have to quickly snap myself out of it because if i do that it's not going to be good i'm not going to ever get to where i'm trying to go if i'm constantly worrying about where i am right now you can't find the joyous moments in where you are right now and like I said, use that pain, use it as ammunition to get to where you're trying to go. Surround yourself by people that understand your situation. And also, too, don't be afraid to get off social media because a lot of the times, a lot of people are always on social media like, oh, this person is doing that, this person is doing this. And you feel like you're missing out on something, baby. As long as you're working towards a bigger plan, you're not missing out on sh You're not missing out on nothing. Nothing at all so this was just my video of just um really just talking to you guys i'm gonna do more videos like this um of course i would love to do more professional videos more vlogs and stuff like that but this is all i got for y'all right now <laughs> so i hope you guys love these videos you guys seem to love my last video when i was talking about relatable content so i think you guys just love to hear me talk so i'm gonna do my best to talk more and just um express my feelings more because i do know that that is god using me as a vessel so i hope i you know gave you guys a sense of clarity as far as just being at peace with your current situation and what you can do to continue to allow Allow yourself to be at peace in your current situation so again you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you guys subscribe follow me on all socials and also check out out loud llc for a mental health coloring book journals pens stickers and more and i will see y'all in the next one bye